Korchala Town. Dalmatian Korchala Town, with almost 5,700 inhabitants, is the largest and central city of the Croatian island Korchala, the second most populous Adriatic island. According to legend, the island was founded by the Trojan hero Aeneas, or his friend Antenor. The Venetian Renaissance influenced the gorgeous architecture in the city. The main attraction of Korchala Town is the medieval walled old town, with its towers, historic buildings, and ancient monuments. You will love walking through the traditional narrow streets typical of Mediterranean towns. You will discover numerous cafes, local restaurants, and charming small galleries here. In the old center, you can even visit the alleged birthplace of Marco Polo here. A local legend is that the famous explorer was born here in 1254. The entrance to the old town is guarded by a massive city gate, a remnant of the defensive walls built in the 13th and 14th centuries. It is an outstanding example of medieval European war architecture, making the town one of Croatia's best preserved medieval fortified towns. In Korčula Bay, near the city walls, there is also the main port and, especially in the warmer months, you can admire the many moored ships and magnificent yachts here. The old town center is dominated by the splendid St. Mark's Cathedral from the 15th century and built in the Gothic Renaissance style. It is the largest church in the city and the construction took a century. Walk inside to see two beautiful paintings by the famous Venetian artist Tintoretto and a bronze statue by the Croatian sculptor Ivan Maestrovic. The locals keep alive old folk customs such as the Mareshka gun dance which dates back to the Middle Ages. It was initially danced only on special occasions, but when you visit the old town, you can see this beautiful traditional dance. Nowadays, performances are held twice a week. Kayaking is one of the most popular ways to explore the turquoise waters of the Adriatic Sea around Korchula Island and enjoy the beautiful Croatian countryside. You can stop for swimming and snorkeling and learn some interesting historical stories with a guide. This activity is suitable for everyone, from beginners to advanced. Just seven kilometers from Korčula, there is a tourist center, Lumbarda. This small fisherman's village has a rich history of over 2,000 years ago. Lumbarda is surrounded by sandy vineyards and supplies magnificent scenery for the sunset and the Adriatic Sea. Do not forget to taste great Mediterranean wines here, such as the well-known Croatian white gurk, made from local grapes. For water sports lovers, the area between the Peliashats Peninsula and the old town of Korčula is ideal for windsurfing and kitesurfing. Ride the winds and waves in the heart of the beautiful Dalmatia. If you've enjoyed this video and want to see more in the future, leave a comment, give a like, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.